find episode 14 with the Maelstrom Prison. We finished Tyrell 5 last time, where we were on a uh, Tyrell 5, which looked very much like Droma Cass, but apparently it wasn't. And now we're heading to the Maelstrom Prison, which I have no idea what planet the Maelstrom Prison is on. Is it even on a planet? I don't think it is. It's somewhere. Somewhere in the depths of space. I, get, I have no idea where I'm going all of this. I make it up as I go along. Music's gotten all serious. Uh, what's going to happen? We're definitely going to skip the cutscene because we don't need to see the ship leave. Just want to go... Whoa! Is that meant to be a planet or is that meant to be a star? What the heck is that meant to be? Okay, okay. Of the enemy on a calf brick. Placing defenses might as well be made of flimsoplast. Find the security control center. Deactivate the internal safeguards. The computer system will reveal the Jedi prisoner's location. Our fleet will move in and provide any support you need. Thanks. Okay. That's, uh... Very pretty, let me just scroll in, and now we have the thumbnail. Oh, don't you hate it when you got to go all the way to the end of a corridor? Drives you insane. Oh, I'm actually too low leveled for this. By seven levels. Okay, then. I mean, it's a good job it upscales you anyway. So, oh, look, a bonus mission I'm probably going to have to do because I can't stealth. And because it's actually in tight corridors to the point I can't actually skip past half the enemies like I did on Tyrell 5. So, uh, there's going to be a lot of editing. But on the bright side, think of all the experience I'm going to get. I mean, I gained three levels in the last episode. I was level 29 when I started, and I was level 32 by the end of it. So, if we're lucky, I could be level 34 or 35 by the end. I said if we're lucky because that's probably not going to happen because you know me. Oh, what's this? Is this a bonus mission as well? Yes, it is. Um, well, I mean, considering I'm probably going to be killing everything in my way anyway, probably could do that bonus mission. How much experience did I get? 16,000 and 16,000. They're also red. Okay. Although, I could literally skip you guys and you guys. Hmm. I kind of feel like I want to do the bonus mission, though. I know it's like a hundred enemies, but yeah, you guys don't have to watch me do it. Like, every single enemy. I mean, I'll skip probably half of the enemies that I kill, so you're probably still going to have to watch me kill 50. But, you know, I'm at 15 already, and I've only been playing for like three minutes, so I'm, I'm, I'm feeling hopeful. I'm feeling very hopeful. Hey, you. Will you get over here? I need to kill you, apparently. You are maximum security droid. Oh, oh, uh, and I can scavenge you as well. Even better. Don't mind me. I'm just going to scavenge you before this droid appears. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And there we go. What the hell was that? I came from above. Again, what? what is shooting me from above? Something is. I. Okay, let me look up and see what shoots me. I'm just guessing with my abilities right now. Okay, well... I can't check anymore because I've killed this guy. This guy is a droid. Well, wow. droids can have genders. How do you know? Guess what? Bye. You died. What? You fell over, stood up, and then fell over again. Right. Oh, I haven't got my buffs up. Oh, silly Charlie. You're always forgetting your buffs, aren't you? Classic Charlie. I am alright. Thanks. Thanks, thanks, Corso. Thanks for caring. Wish you'd care less because I hate you. Oh, I can scavenge you as well. Finally, smaller droids that I can actually scavenge. Thank you. And that's level 65 scavenging. Even though I'm meant to be um, kind of leveling up arms tech and not scavenging for the achievement. But hey, think of all the stuff I can get from scavenging for arms tech. Ha <laughs> ha. You all fell over. You all... You've done it again. Fell over, stood up, and then fell over. Why do you keep doing that? I haven't encountered any bonus mission objectives for a little while. Have I gone past them all? Or was there literally none on the way? Hmm, there was literally none on the way. That's the next one. Fair enough then. Oh, I have to point out as well, I have a bit of a sore throat. Um, so yeah, and I kind of forgot to go get some soothers from the shop today. If you don't know what soothers are, they're like 
Sweets that can help you throw. And, um... I mean, I brought no offend to sort of help with the pain of my throat, but it hasn't helped too much. Uh, soothers probably would have helped a lot more, but I'm an idiot and I forgot them. So, yeah. I get, seriously, yeah, something is shooting me from the sides, but there's no one there. What the hell? I don't get it. Oh, if we encountered our first boss, well then, let me scavenge you. And then let me destroy the munition stockpile. And I'll be right over. After I've destroyed these guys as well. I bet most of you are really surprised I'm actually going for this bonus mission. Because the three of you actually watching is probably so aware that you're all like, but, but Charlie never kills any enemies more than 15 in a bonus mission. Well, I'm, I'm being a rebel today. I'm being a rebel. Whoa, how dare you. Well, guess what? Bonus mission. But what? I can't speak today. I've got a bad throat. Can't speak. Just just ignore half of what I say. Well, you just blow yourself up, why don't you? Bravo. Bravo. You're a, you're a smart, smart droid. Whoa! Thanks for that. At least I don't need to use uh, the cultist stations because I'm probably going to kill him by the time I uh, lose any health. Oh, he's fell over again. Did oh, you fell over. And you're dead. Oh, do I get scavenge you as well? Yeah! How awesome is that? Do I get anything good? Eh. Eh. The scarred man followed you. Hatred. Master Oteg in flames. Mercy is the Jedi's defense. Master Oteg in flames? Master Oteg's gonna burn alive? Is that what you're trying to say? Can you stop speaking in riddles, please? I love how dramatic this music is. Listen. <laughs> so dramatic. Oh, oh, please tell me there's like a thing. Oh, I was hoping there's going to be a thing I could blow you up with. Oh, well. You'll die with the help of my sweeping blasters. And you're dead. I really wish I could scavenge you guys, though. Huh. Why, why are you, Jesus droid, why, why are you shooting upwards? You realise the enemies are on the floor, not up in the sky. Okay. Ooh, I need this. C can I click it please? Thank you. Ooh, well, we'll start out by blowing this up. That'll kill most of you. And then we'll drop this to kill the security droid there. And I was going to say hopefully the overseer droid, but that didn't happen. And then the Sith Wardens. Ah, oh, wait, you know what I should have up? I should be having flash for Ah. And I I don't really have the money for it as well. I could use cartel coins, but I mean I could do one. Yeah, let's do one, why not? Yeah. Ah, screw it, let's do two. That way I get a little bit more experience when doing flash forwards. Did I choose the right one actually? I'm a bit scared I chose the wrong one. Nope, that's fine, chose the right one. Good, good. I really should be using the flashpoint experience boost, not the major experience boosts for this stuff, but never mind. Hi! Do you mind if I use sweeping blasters? Thank you. Does... Are you... I was going to say, are none of you... Does that not affect any of you guys here? I can't tell. I wasn't seeing any hit points coming from you. Oh well. I don't know why I thought there'd be something behind here. I had to go look. I really need to stop using recuperate after every battle because I keep forgetting to do it and I'm just struggling in terms of focus. It's not focus. It's energy. Why do I keep thinking it's called focus? Oh, am I going the right way? Oh, this is the prison archives. Oh, well. Consider yourself all dead anyway. Ooh, the stuff I'm going to scavenge here. Get you, you, and you. Ah, aren't I a lucky boy? My scavenging is now 109. Wow. What was I at the start of this episode? 50 something? And now 109. Well then. Oh, we've got another boss battle ahead of us. Well. Before we go into this boss battle, don't mind me, I need to destroy some munitions. Because it's vitally important. Ah, oh, look at that prison medic. Hiding around the corner so it didn't get hurt. Well, you sir, I hope you died painfully. It's taking a lot longer to level up than it did in the last flashpoint. I'm still not even 33 yet. Oh well. Requiring targets. Calculating optimal fire pattern. You point and shoot. That's the best fire pattern. You're just of flesh. 
I'm much more. Why do you sound like uh, Idris Elba? Oh, I can't scavenge you guys. Or well, maybe it's because I'm in a battle. Oh well. I mean, I could try and move out of his abilities, but to be honest, I'm probably not gonna die. So there's no point. Why did I drop that? I don't need to. Uh, oh no, your implants have run out of power, have they? Oh no. We're taking a lot longer to die than the uh, droid did. But you're there now. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. They always do. What'd you say? They'll rebuild. Right. Uh, you're a cyborg. Let me just use these controls. Your persistence is impressive. Most of my foes have the decency to die quickly. Yes, I arrived before you. I did my time in the nebula. Otek spread his forces too thin. It will cost him his life. And yours. Darth Malgus will be most pleased. Should your master's name mean anything to me? What short memories you people have. Darth Malgus is the Empire's greatest hero. He led the assault on Coruscant's Jedi Temple, killed its leaders. Scurry about our prison. After I destroy your fleet, I'll find you. You forget, Harlow really doesn't care about history. So. This is Okek. We've sliced the enemy's calm frequency. Kilran's got us pinched between his fleet and the prison's autocannons. The Jedi prisoner must be freed, even if it means losing the fleet. As long as we're between you and Kilran, you're protected. Your sacrifice won't be in vain. Take those Imperial ships with you. Whoa! I'll keep the calm channel open so you know what's happening. Goodbye, my friend. Oh, is Oteg actually gonna die? What? what? What the heck is this little thing here? Is this my heroic moment, but bugged out? Oh, that's gonna have to stay there now, isn't it? Oh, God. I kind of wasn't exactly wanting Oteg to properly die in flames, but something tells me that's actually going to happen. Hmm, have I still got bonus mission? Can I still do the bonus mission? Um, oh, stage one is done. Please don't be another hundred. Please don't be another hundred. Uh, okay, I mean, I, I can deal with that one, I think. Clear, yeah, close the gap. I'm, I'm kind of worried I can't do this bonus mission now. Um, I mean, I could go back, but I, I, I thought I got all the consoles and the stockpiles in that area. And it's not exactly saying past there that I can continue doing the bonus mission. Usually it mentions it. Eh. Oh, wait, there's another. Okay, yeah, there's some more consoles behind you. Thank you. I was a bit worried then. Yeah, you kind of need to clean out your uh, your ships. You've got cobwebs everywhere. It's a bit disgusting. Darth Malgus would not be pleased with you. I kind of thought it was going to be another boss, but it's just an unleashed Tarentatech. Is that how you say it? Tarentatech? I think I actually pronounced the name of a beast correctly. That normally never happens. Whoa, I'm actually nearly dead. Whoa, whoa. Thank you, Jesus Troy. If you could heal me, that would be great. But I had to use one of my own med packs there. Not that they cost much, but... Blimey, you're taking a while to die. You might as well be a boss. Wait, here's a thought. Why do I have Corso and Healing Stance when I got Jesus Droid healing me? May have to change that. My word, you took forever. Why did you take forever? Oh god, am I stunned again? Typical. At least I got a, uh... Wait. I was going to say, I thought I could scavenge this uh, beast then, but nope, that's Droid. Uh, seriously? There's more to kill? I thought I killed everything. Ah, we're about to enter the beast pens now, where there's probably going to be hundreds of beasts all over the place. Eh, maybe not hundreds then. Come to Papa! Come on, come on all of you. All of you, come on over. Thank you. That's what I wanted. And then I'll do this. Ah, beautiful. Why are there some beasts that I can and can't kill? I mean, it's not like uh, some of the beasts are just going to be flying there or said they'd be like, Oh, you know what, Aaron? I don't think I'm going to kill anybody. I think I'm just going to sit back and just relax. I, I'm just not feeling it. Okay, I just need one more stockpile and one more console. Well, there's the console. So where's the stockpile? Mm. Level 33. Thank you. Ooh, I can get one of these abilities now. Okay, so which one should we go for? Uh, just target access by 20% after flash grenade. 
Uh, grants to um, each absorbs uh, blah 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 blah. Yeah, let's go for that one. Because I totally know what I just read there. I love how I said I was going to change Corso out of healing stance and put him in damage stance, but I never did until now. Uh, destroy this console. We just need one more stockpile and then we got ourselves 16,000 experience. Hello, bitches! Oh, just, just, just one. Just one. But, heroic moment. Okay, well, that was, uh, a little easier than I thought it was gonna be. Um, right. I, I hope there's some more beasts up ahead, otherwise I'm, I'm kinda screwed. Um, I kinda hope I didn't need to last that fight all the way until I'd got enough beasts. Hmm. Your mess is gone. Concentrate firepower on the Emperor's glory. Don't let it through. I don't think the Emperor's glory. Why am that? Why are they doing Jack S? Okay. Um, yeah, Otek, I don't think the Emperor's glory is uh, a real person. Just gonna point that out. My scavenging is now level 129. I am going the completely wrong way. I have no idea why I've started. Singing Lady Gaga, I was born this way. Yes, I know the song I just sung wasn't born this way. It was Edge of Glory. I just thought, you know, it rhymed with what I was singing. So, <laughs> uh, yeah, that seems important. Um, well, there's some munitions now, so that console just seems vitally important for some reason. Um, I'm hoping after I kill these beasts, that console will come into play. Well, I got this now, so I will take my 16,000 experience. Thank you. And I'll kill that, so I get some more um, experience. And watch this console come into play. There we go. I knew it would be. Yeah, you deal with them. I'm going to sort of destroy this console for whatever reason. Oh, wait. Is this for the bonus boss? Oh, yeah. Bonus boss. Don't mind if I do. That must be awfully boring for you down there. Don't worry, you can come out to play. Here it comes. Wow, that is a massive spike on its body. Here it comes. Come on, hurry up. Well, that was uh, an explosive way to uh, come up from the ground. Hi, cutie pie. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! Don't know what's so yeehaw about it, but yeehaw! Ow! Don't appreciate that. Thanks for that. I kind of hurt. Hurry up, heroic moment. I could really do with you right now before I kill him because it's more fun to kill him with heroic moment than it is with my actual abilities. You're going to be done, but I'm going to be. He's going to be dead by the time my heroic moments even come up. Nope, here we go. Let's use the abilities that don't take forever to load up. Now, this one. Wow, I got to use one ability. Amazing. One wow, you got big feet. One whole ability. But hey, I gained like twenty-five thousand experience, so twenty-seven I think. Hooray. Any other enemies can go to hell unless they are a boss that I actually need to kill. Your boss actually needs to kill Oh it's a good job I've already got for this. I've already got my heroic mission up. I keep saying bonus mission. My heroic mission to make this what? Too what? Easy, will you? Heroic moment. Why do I keep saying heroic mission, bonus mission? Referring to, uh, I don't know. I really don't know. Have a taste of the dark side. Well, I mean, we've already tasted it. A lot of my decisions are dark side, so. Carrier bomber spitting to tell us. Our fighter wings break an attack. Fire it with Oh, it's egg. Oh no, our egg's gonna die. La la la, now that I've done the bonus mission, I do not need to kill any of you. Well, you guys got in my way anyway, so... Bye! Oh, hi. Oh. Uh-oh. Get away from the droid, get away... Damn it, droid! Well, how about a taste of heroic moment, eh? Eh? Before it runs out in... One second! Oh, I was hoping to use more abilities than that, but... Oh, well. Get to scavenge you. So much for Oteg. With his death, Republic's little misadventure here comes to an end. I hope to finish you myself, but Lord Vanathrast beat me to your position. There won't be much left after he's finished. Pity I so enjoy collecting trophies. So do I. I'm gonna get a trophy of your head. 
well, well not really it's just gonna be a stupid decoration but hey it's a trophy nonetheless <laughs> this is easy I'm just gonna use sweeping gunfire just to kill them all cuz uh, this is uh yeah they died pretty easily for a boss okay skip past skip past skip past skip past skip past skip past damn it I don't know why I use any other ability. Sweeping Gunfire is just such an overpowered ability for groups of uh, enemies. Why do I use anything else? Two droids in my way, eh? Wow. Sucks to be you two. If you could just not push me into that droid so I have three droids to deal with, that would be great. Well, the droid's on its way anyway. Oh, thank God for that. <sighs> Decided to patrol away. Thank you, droid. Why there's so many droids? Oh my god, all we need now is for that droid to patrol this way. Thank god it's not. See, even sweeping gunfire works on just one enemy. It's just the perfect ability. Hello? Hello, Grand Moff Kilwin. You're gonna be killed in a moment. Oh, they're going into a phase. So much trouble from one Republic operative, it almost strains credulity. My lord, I promise to rid you of this nuisance. This embarrassing farce ends here. Securing the Emperor's prisoner is your only priority. Deal with this annoyance another time. There's no time like the present, my lord. I'll accomplish both objectives. You've put everything on the line to keep that man. Why? Who is he? You don't even know why you're here. It's fascinating. You are a true patriot. I admire that. But better you should die ignorant. The Empire salutes you, Grand Moff Kilran. I leave you to reclaim your honor. Or lose it. Glory to the Empire! Glory to My honor will be me. Satisfied. What? What? what where, where am I? I have no idea where, why I even am. Something happened, I got knocked back, and now there's a whole bunch of enemies coming after me. Okay. Kieran! I'm going to get you. Why isn't Kieran losing any health? Kieran is literally losing no health right now. Oh, there we go. Okay, no idea of what happened there. Somebody will explain it to me. No, they won't, because nobody watches my Smuggler series. You underestimate my resources. You underestimate me. Just me in general, because I'm amazing. Execute on my mark. Who? Oh, these guys. Hi. Well, you can all just get in a group and die together. Die like the family you supposedly are. Aww. Oh, I can use the next part of Heroic Moment. Don't mind if I do then. They can deal with uh, those ads. And dead. This. There was so much left to conquer. And I've got the achievement for doing the dark versus light stuff. Exciting! Now all I need to do is just get to level 50 with one of my Dark vs. Light characters and I've done the Legacy level! And then i got to do the Valiant level which I'll do off screen um, with these two characters. Introduction Strongholds, I haven't done that one yet! Okay, might try and do that just at the end of uh, this episode. Just, just why not? Just for a little tiny bonus thing. Hello! Jedi prisoner who I know who you are but my character doesn't. Hint, hint, it's Revan. Oh, well, apparently there's two other people doing Maelstrom Prison as well. Where? What's happened? I can feel... No. No. Yes! What have you yes. done? There's nothing to restrain him now. You were the one being restrained. My struggle held the Emperor in check. How did you find me? Your strength fails. You must be free, or all is lost. You should be one with the Force, finally at peace. No peace while you suffer. The Emperor drowns you in black waters. He wants me to be Darth Revan again. Serve him as I did centuries ago. 
You look good for your age, Revan. What's your secret? I led my allies to the galaxy's edge to destroy the Emperor. We didn't understand his true power. I lost everyone. Betrayed from within. The Emperor imprisoned me, kept me alive with Sith alchemy. Used me. What use were you to him locked up in here? I've known both sides of the Force, light and dark. To him, I was a conduit. The Emperor used me as his link to the light side of the Force, the Jedi Order. Through me, he saw visions. But that same link also gave me influence. I convinced the Emperor peace was in his best interest. Tempered his hate. The peace is lost. The Emperor makes his final war. Stop him. Flee this place while you can. Use the enemy's vessel. Oh, Jedi Entity, if only you knew what would happen. Thank you, old friend. I will finish what we started. Who are you? Kylo Ren? I will finish what you started. Hello? Rider of the Maelstrom! Ooh, level 34 as well! Even better! Ah, exciting. Right, now we need to uh, exit the area and then talk to Revan on the Telos! Uh, excuse me, have you seen uh, a nearly 350 year old man walk through here? He's through there? Okay, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you so much. Uh, I think you're nearly 350, something like that. You're over 300 years old for sure. So many lost for my freedom. Half the fleet destroyed. Master Oteg killed by a direct hit on this vessel. Devastating casualties. Your skill with a blaster is impressive. You should enlist in the Republic military, where it can do more good. I'm good. Having a 300-year-old Jedi Master in my debt will be useful. The only payment I can offer is peace. I won't stop until the Sith are only a memory. My link to the Emperor is broken, but I learned a lot as his prisoner. Centuries of knowledge. I'll share everything with the Jedi Council. Then, I'll end this blasted war and the Sith Empire forever. What's your plan for making that happen? There's one secret the Emperor never pried from me. A place called the Foundry. In the wrong hands, it can exterminate civilizations. In my hands, it will save the galaxy. You should return to the fight for as long as it lasts. We were never properly introduced in all the excitement. What should I call you? Revan. It isn't my real name. Never was. But it will do. I'm leaving for Tython. I hope we meet again someday. May the Force be with you. You, you, you just clipped through me, Revan. Um, okay, it's a better blaster than what I've got. It is, and I just need to change the crystal. Awesome. Uh, excuse me a minute, let me just go and get one more achievement for the Dark vs. Light event, since this is like a Dark vs. Light event series. La 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 la, no. just skipping. No. Yes, yes, I'd love one. Thank you, thank you so much. Let me travel to my stronghold and get myself an achievement. Gotta love achievements. Oh, okay. I get no cutscene being all like, ooh, lights, glamour, pollution. Just need to walk, and I've got the achievement. Thank you. I take all of that stuff which I already have. Ah, introduction to strongholds done. What else do I need to do? Uh, complete Shadow of Revan and 1 to 9 of Kotfi, which we won't actually do on screen. Um, the, my plan is to finish up the class story as quickly as I can and then before the event ends, quickly do Shadow of Revan and stuff like that off screen and then come back and sort of show you my progress. So, yeah. But anyway, we'll leave it here for now. Next week, we will be finishing chapter one of the smuggler story so thank you very much for watching ladies and gentlemen and i and corso don't worry about me we never do corso we'll see you next time and a farewell to you